make me a big old bowl of sauerkraut for breakfast. Ah, oh, big bowl of sauerkraut every single morning. It was driving me crazy. I said to my mom, I said, hey, mom, what's up with all the sauerkraut? My dear sweet mother, she just looked at me like a cow looks on an oncoming train, and she leaned right down next to me, and she said, It's good for you! And she tied me to the wall and stuck a funnel in my mouth and force-fed me nothing but sauerkraut until I was 26 and a half years old. That's when I swore that someday, someday I would get out of that basement and travel to a magical faraway place where the sun is always shining and the air smells like warm root beer and the towels are oh so fluffy, where the shriners and the lepers play the ukuleles all day long and anyone on the street will gladly shave your back for a nickel. Waka waka doo doo, yeah. Well, let me tell you people, it wasn't long at all before my dream came true because the very next day a local radio station had this contest to see who could correctly guess the number of molecules on Leonard Nimoy's butt. I was off by three, but I still won the grand prize. That's right, a first-class one-way ticket to Albuquerque. Okay, so wow. everybody watching right now, I just hit the record button during that. This is why What a Geek's on the show. Is I just asked, What a Geek was adjusting his, his game. I asked Brandon to say something so I could just, you know, look at what his volume was. I asked What a Geek to say something, and he just busted out that whole thing, which went on probably 20 seconds longer than you just heard. I have no idea what any of it was, but it was fantastic. So uh, the first main verse of Weird Al's Albuquerque. Okay, okay, I figured when you said Albuquerque at the end, I remember you saying something about that being a Weird Al thing. Mm -hmm. Uh, your gain sounds better, by the way. Uh, okay. It, maybe it could go down a hair, but it, it looked okay. like you were you guys were landing at about the same spot. We'll see. Because Discord that also messes with it a little. That was fucking impressive. I bumped it down a little bit more. Okay, sweet. Um, okay, so Namiel, we're against Blaine, by the way. Namiel, um, Volvadon. A fire type? Mm. Charizard? Rathalos? Yeah, Rathalos would be good for Tangle and Parasect. Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, and nobody cares about Chansey. There and jump in. Who's Chansey? Okay. What's Chansey? I don't understand that. <coughs> I was gonna make a Digimon joke, <coughs> but then coffee went down my windpipe. Give me a second. I was gonna make a Digimon joke, <coughs> but then I couldn't think of Digimon. <coughs> Switch into uh, Volvadon when you get the chance. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> uh, oh. Uh, it was cold coffee, at least. It's okay. It's okay, coffee in the lung. It's, it's a weird start to the episode, everybody. Can I beat Blaine with coffee in my right lung? Ah. <laughs> so Can you beat Blaine because of this minimizing chancy? Oh, shit. Swift. Oh, shit, I used Earthquake. Wh whatever, 75% chance it hits, which means zero. Fuck. Where'd he go? Oh, fuck! Way to go. You wanna just do a mulligan on this? Oh, uh, mulligan! Let's try it again! Uh, hello, welcome back to Pokemon Stadium, <laughs> episode 59. I like that you remembered the episode number. <laughs> Pokemon Technician? I... Okay, uh, Blizzard it is. I don't see any reason to switch. Tangle is somehow faster, uses a wrap. I mean, like, what's the worst he's got is Mega Drain or maybe Razor Leaf. Are you kidding me? Stun Spore. Are you kidding me? Now he is faster. Okay, hold on. Namael is the person we need to take out every single fire type, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Two immediate losses. We <laughs> lost twice immediately because of who came out first. Okay, do I need to rework this team? Uh, no. Should Namael not be out first? Half hmm. of their team is weak to Namael. Half of their team kind no. of isn't. Yeah, no. yeah. Keep Namael at in the front. One, two, three, four, five of their five of their six Pokemon are weak to Namael. In some capacity, you have Blizzard yeah. on Namael. Now, I know some people are probably going to comment and say, like, hey, don't be so hasty on the load state on that. Do you really want to see us lose for 10 minutes twice in a row? Do you want to see the winning attempt be 25 minutes into this episode? <laughs> okay, how's it going to happen this time? I don't want to just start loading until things are advantageous in the beginning. But if we get fucked that bad and we know we're doomed, peace out. Okay, I'm gonna commit to this with Namael. What can I do? Treat him lightly and you'll get burned. I'm gonna Psychic. 
What happens? Am I going to drop his special? Am I going to crit? I'm going to say that Remember, he's going to try minimizing. Fuck. Yeah, I'm... Chansey's a special tank. We probably shouldn't be sticking yeah. with Namiel. That's why I suggested it in the first place to switch. But they've got Ice Beam, and the only physical thing we can switch to... Well, I guess Rathalos with Fly? Rathalos no, Rathalos would still get uh, hit by Ice moves. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cause... Right, because yeah. he doesn't resist it yet. Oh, this is really bad. Um, I think this is just the game getting back at you, because you always say that Blaine is the worst. Maybe I should be opening with Volvodon, because Volvodon's good against the fire types anyway. Uh, fire Blast. What now? If I get burned. Okay, thank God. Ah! Oh! Yeah, because Chansey also has a high special attack in this game because yeah. it's combined. Yeah. To. Okay, at least Earthquake does a lot, but. Yeah, but I think, this I is think a death, isn't here? it? Yeah. And then all we have are special attacks after that, besides Rathlos, who's got Fly, well, which is already fly. inaccurate. So we can we can hope. If Fly doesn't beat Chansey, I think we lose. I mean, Fly's not inaccurate. It, it misses 1 in 20 times, but that doesn't do us any favors. Uh, yeah. Fly it is, I guess. Well, at least we're faster. Fuck! <laughs> Oh, okay, awesome. this Chansey is terrible. Oh, crit! That works. Oh, okay, well, no. Not even close. Less than I expected. Ice Beam. I forget, do I have Slash on uh, Rathalos? I feel like you I do. do. Yeah. You d okay! And Mulligan. <laughs> okay! <laughs> okay! New team! Volvodon, Namael, mm, mm, Rathalos, because sure. they're still Parasect. Okay. Okay, so I'm just. A, so same it's not a team. new team, it's a new order. New order. Volvodon first. Now it won't be Chansey. <laughs> you called it. All right, switch to um to Rathalos. Okay, okay. Now hopefully Watch, he's, he's on you. I was gonna say now if if he's if he's playing fair, he's probably using Mega Drain. If he's being an asshole, he's probably using Spore. He's using Stun Spore. That's a strange. So that's thing. half. That's halfway between a smart move and being an asshole. Yeah, I don't really know what to think of that move, to be honest. That was a weird play. I don't know why he would have done that against Rathalos. Like, if he cheats and knows we're switching to Rathalos, I don't know why he wouldn't use Spore. If he didn't cheat and thought we were still staying with Volvodon, I don't know why he didn't use a grass move. Come wow. on. Are you kidding me? We're almost 10 minutes in. What a furious battle. Catchphrase. We only need one flamethrower. We only need one flamethrower. Okay. There we go. Uh, okay. He's double weak to it. <sighs> just that silence is we're all just like, it better fucking hit zero. <laughs> just shaking my head. Ooh. Next is... Oh, Charizard. <laughs> Okay, we have Namael, so Charizard's not bad. Do we just sacrifice Rathalos then? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just use, just use Fisher. <laughs> <laughs> Basically tell him, I'm not going to win this fight as it is. So. I went for Slash for the record, but it didn't matter. I mean, there was no way we'd hit. Okay. Namael. I don't see a reason to use... Well... Rock no. Slide would have been strong as fuck, but I'm still using Namael. But Surf's pretty, pretty strong. Surf is real good. Stab Surf with Namael is one of our better moves. And we're faster. 
And we crit. Okay. Okay, two on one. What do we got? Come on, don't be the grass type. Don't do this to me. If it is the grass type, you're still you've still got you're blizzard. Yeah. That's true. We stand a fighting chance. Rapidash, oh, Rapidash. I think we win. Yeah. We do just win. This was a lot of very fast battles, mostly because we either got immediately killed, or this fight where it's just high damage back and forth fast. Don't flinch. Interesting, interesting stomp. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> At least the stomp was a stomp in this game. Yeah. Fire spin. Oh, oh no, that you works like rap in this one, doesn't it? Yeah, so we have to switch. Okay, we do get a free switch because of that. Let's just switch to Volvodon and Earthquake. Okay, the intense battle continues. I, w I want to, like, I just want to see it happen where the trainer, like, walks into the gym, they go to fight the gym leader, and he's like, I'm going to use Stun Spore, and your Pokemon's paralyzed, and they're just like, no, I'm out. Toxic. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, um, I mean, it's less frustrating than Fire Spin hitting again. Yeah, also, whenever you switch out, it'll be, uh, regular poison again. Yeah. Oh, wow. This one's gonna be close, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Yay. Please, miss. We know we win. Ah, uh, we already know we win. Don't drag it out, game. Come on. The thing that really drags it out is all the animations that I have to play. Mm-hmm. And then you're going to switch. So it's going to play the animation of you switching. I don't remember. Did Pokemon Stadium do anything to speed it up? I don't think so. I don't recall. I don't, I don't think it did, but it could have had some like subtle things that I just didn't notice as a kid. Okay. Okay. I half expected it to go to Rapidash. I kind of thought it would, too. <laughs> I kind of thought, you know, speed tie. Well, I think I did pretty well for a guy with coffee in my lung. That's the excuse. I had bad luck because of coffee. I don't think that's how that, like, luck works, but okay. Didn't you know? If you have coffee in your lung, lung it's like, um, it's a debuff to your luck stat. Oh. Your special stats are down, I see. Brandon, can you tell me what the fuck luck does in Oblivion? You can get two points in it every single level up if you want to. It's not attached to any skills. The number you get is always two. And it says in the description, it dictates everything, but is not attached to any skill. I went on one of the two, um, one of the two Elder Scrolls wikis, looked up yeah. luck, and it did not explain in plain English what the hell it does. It, it gave some, some like, general things of, like, oh, it helps everything you do. It didn't actually list anything. The only thing it listed was the math on how it breaks down, but it doesn't tell you how to read the math, and so it's just this really long string of, like, really complicated math that includes, like, player level and, like, acronyms that it does not explain on the same page what the acronyms correlate to. Like, it... Maybe the other wiki explains it better. I don't know. Do you know what the hell that does in Elder Scrolls Oblivion? Um, yeah, Elder Scrolls Oblivion. So, of all the checks you can do in the game, you have, like, all your whatever checks, whatever, and their numbers are set. Based on your luck stat, it adds a value to those, like, secretly. Mm -hmm. So, having a certain amount of luck is, like, an all stats up. Okay. It's like an all skills up. Just, but it doesn't tell you that. Right. So for for like an example of if you have a 60, a luck of 60, your skills are then influenced and increased by four. Okay. Okay. I can, I can see the appeal of that. I don't know if I'd put a whole lot of levels worth attributes in it unless I have a particularly shit level up. But I understand the appeal of a fortify luck spell because that would be pretty easy to max out. And fortify luck goes beyond the threshold of. Ooh, the luck yeah. Stat. 
you could oh. potentially get pretty strong through that. You could fortify luck on top of fortifying, say, speed and athletics and get pretty ridiculous running speeds. Yeah. Hmm. That's I gotta keep that in mind for the next uh, Oblivion challenge I work on. Uh, okay, so we're against a rocket grunt here. Um, Cat that's... Act 2. I really... <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. Okay, Cat Act Two is so weird, especially considering it's not the cat on the team. Um, I don't. If like you bring Persia. Namiel, you're going to be good against three of these things. Uh, yeah. Kadachi's good against two of them. And and whatever Yo is just good? yeah, whatever Yo's fine. Yeah, let's just go with that. Um, good for paralysis I, and tanking hits. I get a little Persian nervous whenever we run into Persian again because Persian's been kind of a sleeper beast in this Let's Play, hasn't it? Persian's yeah. messed us up a lot. Okay, so we're okay here. Kind of, yeah. I'm fine with seeing where this goes. I will Psychic, because it's like pretty much the same as Surf, but has a chance of a special draw. Here's the first move. Oh, wheel, wheel, wheel. It was good, mm. I guess. Sure. 80 damage. Ooh, this might hurt. <laughs> Paralyzed. Oh. oh wow. Okay, we hit each other for about the same amount of our health bar. Please give me uh, a special drop. You did almost 80 and he did. You don't really need a special drop at this point. Hey! Because <laughs> it's I'm using so body slam. Well, I'm worried he's going to crit me and kill me and someone else needs to finish it. Ooh. Eh. You're fine. Well, he'll go down. I don't know what is next, though. I'm kind of hoping, like, Golbat. I could probably take that down in one psychic. Whatever it is, you're probably faster. Probably. so brutal every time. I know! <laughs> the baby just gets launched out. Ah, cat act. Mm. <laughs> cat act? That's a weird cat. Uh, I would recommend switching just so you don't have to sacrifice Namiel. Mm, Whatever, yo. Whatever, yo. We don't specifically really need him for anything. He'd be good against him. He'd, he'd be okay against a bunch of shit. Slash is what I'm assuming it's going to use. Don't eradicate? Really yeah. It doesn't I, know I, slash. Yeah, I'd it assume hyper fang, but I hope not super fang. Dig. Digging. This is he's, fine. Yeah, he's faster. He's right? faster. He's faster. Okay, yeah. I will paralyze him. Sure. Um, uh, That's weird. My controller is not. Oh, there we go. It just disconnected. That was weird. Hope it didn't like run out of battery. Huh. Okay, it's good. It's it's connected now. Weird. Huh. Okay. Well, Dig did almost nothing. Sweet. Oops. I love the oops as if it's like an accident. It discon. I think my battery is out on this controller. Hmm. Uh, you hey, want to switch hey. over to Brandon? Let's switch over to somebody. Hey, Brandon, you want to yeah. take over the fight? Sure. Hey, everybody, we're back. It's been five minutes. We couldn't get it to load either of their controller profiles, and we don't know why. Suddenly, my controller's connected again. It just is. I, I don't know. Hyperkin Admiral, everybody. In oh, it didn't accept a button input for a second. I don't know if it's like dropping the Bluetooth. I don't know. Believe me, I would have it plugged in by, like, USB, but it actually can't connect to PC through USB. It can only... Like, it'll charge that way, but it can only actually play games through Bluetooth. So... I don't know! <laughs> hope... Hope for the best. Fuck. Okay. Okay, it went down. I assume it would allow you guys to control again if you manually put your controls back in. I think it's yeah, a problem with Yeah, but that takes the... time. Yeah, that does take time. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll try and do it again between episodes if this controller keeps being an issue. Hyper beam. Oh, and he's high speed. Yeah, but it's not going to do much. Yeah, but high speed means high crit chance. Yeah. Okay, well, we do beat it, because even if it hangs on from this, it's recharging now. What a furious battle. 
What a furious battle. Catchphrase. I... Okay. For a second I thought he's switching, and I was gonna say, wait, what? Forgot that it plays an animation for recharging. Or says it's recharging while playing the idle animation. Yeah. Yay! Yay! And the cursed Let's Play continues! <laughs> and the crowd goes mild. We're so close. We're so close to the end of the Elite Four. But you know what that means? That means we have to finish all the tournaments, of which there's many. <laughs> In a way, you're not wrong when you say we're close to beating the Elite Four. But I, f I think you mean the Pokemon League? You know what I mean. I do know uh, what you mean. I know that. It's in the book. Um, Lab Man. Okay, uh, Namael is still a good choice, as it often is. I don't mind Kadachi. Volvodon yeah. is... F uh, Volvodon would be good for switching into Magneton. I'm gonna go Namael, Kadachi, Volvodon, and just see how that goes. Okay. How will the gym's second opponent conduct battles? I forgot about Alfear. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna Blizzard, thunder. I guess. Uh, Blizzard is accurate. Oh yeah, that's right. In Gen One, it's still like 85, which is not bad for such a strong move. Or was it even higher than that? I think it, might be I think it was around 80, 85. Oh, hey, look at that! Oh my God, it's a flying ice cube. Not to be confused with flying ice cube. That's just ice cube in his private jet. Did it stay in the air, too? Yes. Just Thunderbolt. I'm gonna, yeah, Thunderbolt, because whatever he switches into will still probably be weak to... Okay. Okay, he decided not to switch. That's... You know what? That's probably a smart choice. Just let it die. It's useless anyway. Well, it had one final use, the free switch. Yeah. Smarter than when with that Hypno uh, on Sabrina when they switched when they... For no reason, they could have just let it die for a free switch. Um, he's rock and water, so... Thunderbolt. Yeah, Thunderbolt. I think the worst it could do to you is Slash, because even though it could learn Absorb as a uh, Kabuto, maybe even... Uh, Ooh. Maybe even Mega Drain. It's still not going to do much. It's a physical attacker. Yeah, okay. One double team is the end of the world. We still have a 75% chance of taking him out here. You probably jinxed it. Haha! -ha! Nope. That you wasn't didn't jinx it. That wasn't jinx. That was That was Cobble Cobble Tops. Tops. I'm sorry, that was no. Tops Cab. Was oh yeah, Tops you're right. Cab. Come on. Yeah. Sorry, I'm a bad Pokemon trainer. I know. I know. It's in the book. <laughs> okay, psychic it is. Well, this was an easy trainer then. I would say we lucked out on the freeze, but was Pharaoh really going to do anything that bad? Um, Horn Drill. Mm, yeah, I, I guess Horn Drill could have really hurt, especially if it was a crit. I don't... Whoa! <laughs> okay, think about what I just said, by the way. I know you got four hours of sleep last night, but Horn Drill is a one-hit KO move. Sorry, I was, I was thinking Drill Peck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, if they have almost the same fucking name, they're on the same Pokemon, they have the same animation. Uh, I don't think Firo can learn Horn Drill, but uh, funnily enough, it can learn Drill Run later on in uh, future games. It can't learn Horn Drill? No, it cannot, huh. because it's got a beak, not a horn. Um, don't but... you... What about Gold <laughs> No, anyway, Peck versus Horn Attack. <laughs> Usually something that can learn Peck has a horn and not the other way around. Like, Peck and Horn Attack would have a horn and not a beak. So, there, there's that. Unless Game Freak just decides to fuck on us, which is not right? rare. Like, can you imagine if Firo got uh, yeah, here's, Horn Drill? Here's cool. Okay, who normally has Horn Drill in Gen 1? Is it just Rhydon? Nidoking, I think. Probably Nidoking. Probably. Although Nidoking might learn... Okay, no, I was going to say Nidoking might learn Fissure, but I think that's TM only. Mm-hmm. Nidoqueen, maybe? Maybe? I don't know. It's been a while since I've looked at who can learn Horn Drill. 
especially in Gen 1 specifically, you know? Yeah. Um, oh, uh, Sea King. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yes, you're right. By level up, the only Pokemon who can ever, ever learn it by level up. Rhyhorn, Rhydon, Goldeen, Sea King, Rhyperior, and Exadrill. Okay, those make sense. Uh... Mm. Well... Don't like Zapdos. Uh, yeah. Don't like Tentacruel. Don't like Clefable. Uh, Kadachi is a good start here. And then I'd say bring Volvodon as well. Yeah, for Zapdos. And pretend, potentially for um, Drioster. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cruel Store. Oof. Zapster. Namael is usually goal. a safe choice. Yeah, bring Namael because against Tentacruel and... Um, Amistar, I guess. And maybe even Dodrio. Oh, Getting wait. pretty good. I just realized we're at the end of the episode. Oh, God. Well, oh, God. I'd say On switch the... <laughs> into Volvodon for the next episode. On the next episode, everybody, we absolutely 100% switch into Volvodon. Until next time, have a nice day. See ya.